So I just got back from boot camp, got ready for the day. I actually just finished my protein coffee. I do four shots of espresso, my collagen for her, just better fiber, and then I put in a protein shake. It's so good, and it gets me 30 grams of protein right out of the gate, and it gives me all the latte vibes with protein. So I just finished my protein coffee, and I am going to have some breakfast, and then I'll sit down and share my outfit of the day with you. So what I'm gonna do for breakfast is I'm going to have one of my lemon ricotta pancakes. These are the ones that I made in my meal prep. If you missed this week's meal prep, I'll link it down below for you. These are amazing and they are so filling because they are pancakes packed with protein. They're really, really good. So I'm going to go ahead and have one of those. I do add a teaspoon of Kerrygold butter to that. And then I do add about a tablespoon of Lakanto maple syrup. I do have a 15% off discount code for Lakanto, so I'll link that down below for you. And then I have this little fresh fruit mixture from Trader Joe's, so I'm going to have some fruit as well. So here is my breakfast. So I have my lemon ricotta protein pancake with my butter and syrup, and then I have the rest of that fruit from Trader Joe's, which needs to be eaten up, so that's absolutely perfect. I'll go ahead and put points, calories, macros here on the screen for you. I just finished my breakfast and I wanted to share with you guys my outfit of the day. I've gotten so many comments that you guys love seeing the outfit that I'm wearing. And you already know, most of my outfits come from Timu and today is no exception. My entire outfit from all of my jewelry down to my shoes is from Timu. I actually picked up a few pieces for my upcoming trip. If you follow me, you know that I'm heading to New Orleans on Wednesday. It is Monday that I'm filming this video. So when you guys see this, I will be on my way to New Orleans. So I picked up a few pieces from Timu to bring on my trip. I'm gonna share with you the pieces that I picked up for my trip and then I'll share with you the actual outfit that I'm wearing today. This is actually a dress and I decided to pick up a couple of these long, flowy, silky smooth, maxi dresses that'll be perfect for New Orleans. I can pair them with a jacket if it's cooler out or wear them as is if it's warm and the weather is going to be kind of hit and miss. There's some warmer days, some cooler days. So I picked up the one I have on, which I'll share with you. And then I decided to grab a floral design. I love this pink color. I have been wanting to add a little bit more bright pink to my wardrobe. And when I saw this on Timu's website, I had to pick it up. This is the floral print spaghetti dress. This is $4.28. Yes, $4. It is full length maxi dress. It is very soft, very silky. I was afraid that it was going to cling to all the lumps and bumps and it does not. It flows beautifully on the body, is very, very flattering. I love the spaghetti straps and that they are adjustable. I picked my dress up in a size large, which is a US 8 to 10, and it fits beautifully. So I love this. I'm very excited to take this with me. It does have that little pop of blue, so I thought it would be cute with a denim jacket for the cooler days. And then I grabbed a few more casual pieces. Most of the conference that I'm going to is more on the casual side. And I loved this little tank top. I love that it has this button detail down the front that you can button or unbutton. It is so buttery soft. And I love the kind of washed blue color. This is the button down sleeveless cami top. It is $8.48. It comes in sizes small through extra, extra large. And there's about 10 different colors. Colors. Mine is in a size large and I feel like it fits me perfectly and I loved it paired with these jeans. Let's talk about the jeans. I always say I love Timu jeans. They're my favorite jeans. They're the ones I reach for the most. What I love most about Timu jeans is 90% of them have a good amount of stretch to them. So they are so incredibly comfortable. So I wanted to get kind of a different style of jean. These are a very flare legged style jean. And let me just tell you how figure flattering these are. The flare leg really just makes you look long and lean. These are the water ripple embossed slash pocket wide seam flare jeans. They're $19.28. They come in sizes small through extra, extra large in light blue and dark blue. I did go ahead and pick mine up in the dark blue. I do like the little bit of wash and honestly, I wasn't sure I'd love the flare leg jeans, but I really love the flare leg jeans. So I'm definitely packing these. And then a couple other casual pieces. I love orange. As you can see, I'm wearing orange today. It's one of my favorite colors to wear. And I saw this super cute tank top. I love this little keyhole design with the straps. Super, super cute. And you can dress this up a little bit. This would be really cute paired with the jeans as well. This is the solid sleeveless v-neck 
tank top. It's $7.48. It comes in five colors, sizes small through extra, extra large. I got mine in a size large and it fits perfectly. I mean, I even could have gotten a medium in the tops, but I like that they're a little bit more flowy. And like I said, I love this orange design. This is also super soft and super high quality. And then I wanted a pair of really comfortable shorts to wear to bed on my trip. And I thought that these were so cute. How fun is this? that it's pink, which is Victoria's Secrets line, for a much more affordable price. I love that these are cotton, elastic waist with a drawstring. These are the letter print wide leg shorts, high waisted. They come in three different colors. They're a whole whopping $5.79 and come in sizes small through extra large. I picked mine up in a large and they fit me perfectly. And the drawstring is functioning, so you are able to tighten them a little bit. We don't need to pay Victoria's Secret prices when we can get these for less than $6 on Timu's website. So I'm going to bring these as pajamas. And then my outfit today. I like that floral long maxi dress. I picked this tie-dye one up. Again, it's orange and I love the pop of navy blue. This is the tie-dye spaghetti dress v-neck casual ankle length cami dress. It's $9.98. Comes in sizes small through extra, extra large, and it actually comes in seven different colors. Like I said, I went with orange. I love orange. I think it's very flattering with my eye color and my skin tone, and I thought that it was perfect for spring and summer. This is literally the most comfortable dress I've ever worn. It is so soft. It is so silky. And again, so flattering on the figure. It doesn't hug the lumps and bumps like I thought that it would. And I love the length of it, that it's full length. It is just so comfortable. I feel like I'm wearing pajamas. So I know because it's so comfortable, I'll be reaching for this in the floral one a lot. I did pick mine up in a size large. It is perfect. I could have gotten a medium, but I like the flowiness of the size large. And then I grabbed these bracelets because I thought that these paired really nice with the dress. These are $2.08. It's the crystal resin cluster bracelets. It actually comes in six different colors. I have the gray yellow ones that I picked up from a different haul. I'm going to go ahead and order all the colors because these are really nice quality for $2 and you can't beat that for a stack of four bracelets. So these, I, these are more neutral colors. So they'll go with all of my outfit. And then my earrings, these are so, so cute. I love these and guess what? These earrings are a dollar eight, one dollar and eight cents. These are the vintage jewel water drop earrings. They come in a couple of colors. I like this more blue kind of tie dyed looking color. I thought it paired perfectly with my dress and they're a dollar and they are such good quality. Like I always say, the jewelry blows me away. I also grabbed this necklace off of their website. This is a little out of my comfort zone, but once I got it and put it on, I really love this. I like that it's a little bit longer length and it is this pretty moon wrapped in kind of a gold metal. This is a whole whopping $2.88 and this is the Energy Natural Moon Tree of Life necklace. It comes in seven different colors. I got mine in kind of that white, Opal. I thought that would pair really nice with multiple outfits. It is not, the length is not adjustable unless you added some type of jewelry extender or something to it, but I think it falls at the perfect length. And like I said, the quality of the jewelry cannot be beat. It's less than $3. And last but not least are my shoes. That's another thing I love getting from Timu. I can't tell you the last time I bought jewelry, really clothes or shoes anywhere other than Timu. The quality of the shoes is amazing. And I love these black flat strappy sandals. They're a versatile neutral color that will go with everything. These are the flat ankle strap sandals. They're open toe. They're $8.28 and they actually come in six different colors. I decided to get mine in black and they are so comfortable. I love them. I'm going to buy more colors of these and for less than $10 for high quality comfortable shoes. I mean, seriously, you can't beat it. I do have a 30% off discount code for new customers. I'll pop it up here on the screen for you. And of course I will link it down in the description box and I'll link everything that I shared with you today. If you're interested in picking up any of these pieces for your Yourself. Get him, Lola. Get Palmer. This is an every morning routine around here. Yeah, get it. Get the baby. Palmer. Oh, <gasps> show Lola. Get the baby, Lola. Get him. Oh. Yeah, get him, Lola. Get him. <laughs> These two. Yeah, get him. Get him. Get him. Get the crazy. Oh, yeah, get the baby. Oh, yeah, good girl, Lola. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, we are venturing out for the first time today. We're gonna go out a little bit later too. I have to go pick up my groceries. So I did a Walmart 
grocery pickup. Oh, I guess I should put my seatbelt on. Um, I did a Walmart grocery pickup for the week because again, I'm heading out of town on Wednesday and I didn't need a whole lot of groceries and I don't have time to actually go grocery shopping. Today and tomorrow are just packed busy before I head out of town. So we, I have to go pick up my Walmart groceries. Most of it's going to be for Troy, but I did pick up a few things so that when I got back from my trip, I can get back to my normal food, my normal eating. I need to go to the post office. I've got to mail my bills and I've got to mail out a package for my Facebook challenge group giveaway. And then a little bit later today, we're going to head out again because little Miss Lola Clayton needs her nails cut because her nails are ridiculously long. So I'm going to take her really quick to get her nails cut. I have coaching calls this afternoon and today is just kind of a day of catching up, getting videos edited, content ready for while I'm gone. Uh, there will be a weigh in on Friday. There will be a grocery haul on Saturday. There will not be a video on Sunday and there will not be a meal prep on Monday. I actually come home Sunday at like almost midnight. So I won't be doing any type of meal prepping or video on those days. So just kind of heads up on that. I am going to go to Dutch Brothers for coffee since I am in that area. Actually, Walmart is in the same parking lot as Dutch Brothers. So I'm going to grab another coffee, just my huge, my iced Americano. So a Lola update actually on Lola and her chemo. So as of last Tuesday, she was halfway through her chemo, which is crazy to me that it's already been eight weeks of chemo and then two weeks off. I can't believe how fast it's gone actually. And she's doing great. She, like I said, is in full remission. Her lymph nodes are a normal size. Her blood work is perfect. They did this last week up the amount of chemo medication that they gave her this last week and the week before. So she did have a little bit of side effects. She was a little nauseous for a couple days. So I gave her anti-nausea medicine and that seemed to really help. It's also kind of weird because the first two to three days after chemo, she doesn't really eat her kibble. So if I give her canned food, she'll eat it and she'll eat treats, but she won't eat her kibble. So I'm guessing that's because she, like I said, she's a little bit nauseous after this higher dose, but they wanted to up the dose because that will help kill all the cancer cells, which is obviously what we're all about. So she handled it well overall. So we're going to keep it that higher dose. So tomorrow she actually has to go back just for blood work. And it's so frustrating because it's like 30 to 35 minutes each way. And the blood work takes 10 minutes. So Troy, is actually going to take her tomorrow. And then what I'm going to do while they're gone is pack because she freaks out when I pack. She starts to mope and gets just really depressed because she knows that I'm leaving. So I think what I'm going to do is while he takes her for blood work, I'm going to completely pack and throw my suitcase in the car. So she's none the wiser. And then I actually, my flight leaves at five 25 in the morning on Wednesday. Oh, it's going to be a long day. So I'm going to have to be out of the house by about 3.30 to get to the airport in time for my flight. So I figure if my suitcase is in the car, she'll, she won't know that I packed. And then all I'll have to do before we head to the airport is throw in my makeup. So that is the plan. So ready for some more coffee. Got my coffee. It is phenomenal as always. So I'm just driving over to Walmart. It's literally in the same parking lot to pick up my groceries. Brothers is such a fun coffee shop. They always have really good music playing. Everybody that works there is really nice. And one thing I noticed is that most of the employees are men and actually on the door to the coffee shop, it says Broista entrance, like B-R-O-I-S-T-A instead of barista. So I think that's really cool that they hire a lot of men. And like I said, everybody is super, super nice there. And the coffee is always good unlike other coffee shops that I go to, Duncan. I had to go move my medicine ball in the back because it was rolling all around and I wanted to make sure there was room for them to put in the groceries. Hello. Hello good morning. Good morning. Jennifer Clayton. Thank you, Jennifer. My name is Roberto. Sorry for your Nope, you're good. Thank you. Yep. I figured you'd want my ID. Thank you for understanding. Yep. Okay. 
Thank you very much. You can push the button. Yeah, thank you. Have a good one. So for lunch today, I'm going to assemble one of the wraps that I did in Monday's meal prep. Again, I'll link that video if you missed it. So I'm going to use one half of a Joseph's Lavash bread. I do about a quarter of an avocado, a tablespoon of Bolt House Chunky Blue Cheese, fresh tomatoes, four slices of the Hillshire Naturals turkey breast, a hard boiled egg and some romaine lettuce. So basically it's a Cobb salad wrap. And then I'm going to have a serving of the Cascio e Pepe Puffs. I really, really like these. And I feel like having a chip or something crunchy with my lunch. So I have my wrap, and by the way, these are amazing. And then I have a serving of the Pepe chip things from Trader Joe's. So I'll go ahead and put points, calories, macros here on the screen for you. Little Missy's gonna get her nails cut. They are so long, you hear her clicking. Are you getting your nails cut? <gasps> Lola, are you getting your nails cut? Come on, just go to Wig and Whiskers. Right in here. Come on, Lola. All right, nails are cut. Hey, Lola. Lola, I'm so, I'm so pretty now. So, I'm so pretty now. She literally shakes now when we come here because she shakes at the oncologist and I think she thought that's where we were. He had to hold her as you saw to cut her nails. She was not a happy camper, but we're gonna head home. We'll give her a treat and I've got some coaching calls this afternoon. So for my afternoon snack, I'm going to have a protein shake, but I have this new concoction that I've really been loving it completely gives me milkshake vibes and it is packed with protein so first you're going to start with the fair life chocolate milk now this is 140 calories for one cup it is 13 grams of protein it's a little more fat a little more calories a little more points because it's chocolate milk and it's two percent but it is so good legit chocolate milk and then i'm using the clean simple eats german chocolate cake protein powder you can actually use any of the protein powders from clean simple eats i've made it with the s'mores i've made it with the coconut cream the vanilla it doesn't really matter what protein powder you use, but I'll tell you that the ones from Clean Simple Eats are the best. But I like the German chocolate cake and the chocolate milk together. And then I just add some ice, blend it up, and it's literally like a milkshake. So let me show you how to put together my new favorite shake. So I have my Nutribullet cup. I'm going to add one cup or eight ounces of chocolate milk. So I have my scale set to fluid ounces. And then I add my packet of Clean Simple Eats protein. And then I just drop in some ice cubes and then blend it up. Super simple and I'm telling you it's one of my favorite, if not my favorite protein shake. Look at that, it's literal milkshake. It's so good. The chocolate milk is 100% worth the extra calories and points because it just makes this literally into a milkshake. And then I like to top it with some whipped cream. Right now I'm using the Zero Sugar Ready Whip. So good. I taste the coconut, I taste everything German chocolate in here. You gotta get the Clean Simple Eats Protein. I'll link it down below with a discount and make this because it is a 10 out of 10. For dinner tonight, I am making taco spaghetti. So we're making a spin on spaghetti with taco seasoning. I am out of onions. The recipe does call for half of an onion, but let me show you what else you'll need. So you'll need a can of fire roasted diced tomatoes, taco seasoning, a pound of 96 or 93% ground beef, cilantro, one third less fat cream cheese, light shredded cheese, and then pasta of your choice. So into my caraway Dutch oven, you guys know I'm obsessed with my caraway cookware. I'll link them down below for you. I'm going to add a pound of ground beef. You would also add in your onion if you had one and our taco seasoning. A packet of taco seasoning and then we're going to let the ground beef brown. 
I ended up adding some minced onion in place of regular onion. I'm going to add my can of fire roasted diced tomatoes, eight ounces of pasta, three cups of water, and we're going to allow this to come to a boil and start cooking the pasta. Once your pasta is almost cooked through, we're going to add in four ounces of one-third less fat cream cheese. And stir that in. You can even put the lid back on your Dutch oven and allow that to melt completely. And then lastly, I'm adding half of a cup of light shredded cheese. We're gonna let that melt in with the pasta, serve it up, and I'll be back to share points, calories, and macros. So here is dinner. I will tell you this smells amazing. I did top it with a little bit of fresh cilantro. You can also mix that in if you would like. It makes six servings total, so it is a good size serving. I'll go ahead and put all of the information here on the screen for you. So it's just about the end of the night. I'm going to go take a shower, wash my hair, it's hair washing day. I'm going to self tan to get ready for my trip. And then I have a new facial device that helps with anti-aging, puffiness, also helps with this chicken skin that you can get on your neck with weight loss and just overall youthfulness of the skin. I'm going to show you that because I'm packing it to take it with me on my trip. It's from the brand UC. I've worked with them before. I have their red light therapy period belt, which is amazing to help with cramps. And they just released this new facial device that I'm super excited about. About. This is the four in one facial wand. It comes in both black and pink. Of course, I had to get pink. This is clinically proven and recommended by dermatologists worldwide. It combines four powerful skin health boosting technologies for the ultimate pre programmed five minute daily treatment. It removes blemishes, fine lines, wrinkles, and acne scars. It includes powerful anti aging benefits to promote cell renewal and improve skin elasticity. It is gentle and non evasive beauty treatment perfect for at-home use. Use in combination with Renew Complex Serum or any facial serum for transformative results. Results can be seen in as little as a few weeks. Say goodbye to expensive salon treatments and hello to at-home skincare. I love the magnetic charging. It's convenient to use. You can charge it one of two ways using a USB connection, either in the little holder or by connecting the magnet charging port to the bottom of the wand. It helps deeply rejuvenate the skin and promotes new collagen formation. It is more effective than regular massage wand and about 10 times faster. What I love about it is the 360 degree rotating head. That way you can use it in different areas like eyes, cheeks, jaw, neck, and upper lip. 94% of clients obtain good results within about two weeks or 14 days. I've really been loving it and it's been a great tool for me to use for anti-aging as well as fine lines and wrinkles. You know I'm 47 so we have fine lines and wrinkles so it definitely helps with that and I love how small and USB, how small and portable it is and that it's a USB charge so I can take it traveling. I will go ahead and link the red light therapy wand down below for you with a discount, highly recommend. This is gonna be dessert tonight. I'm going to have the Quest peanut butter cups. These are amazing. They're 190 calories and they have 11 grams of protein in a peanut butter cup. I would say they're pretty similar to Reese's. Maybe not as much peanut butter as a Reese's, but seriously a great dupe. And again, can't beat 11 grams of protein. One net carb for both of the peanut butter cups and 190 calories. I'll put all the points and everything here on the screen. on today's What I Ate in a Day on WW. I hope you enjoyed seeing all my good food throughout the day, coming along with me, seeing my outfit of the day, all those fun clothes from Timu, the facial device. There's so many great things in today's video. If you enjoyed it, give it a big, huge thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe and turn your bell on because I do a What I Eat in a Day every Wednesday. Don't forget to check out the description box down below. I will link everything I shared with you in today's video, nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my other favorite things and come join our Facebook group. We'd love to have you. Thank you for watching. Happy Wednesday, and I'll see you next time. Bye.